Get that one out. Get the other one out. Get the other one out. Okay, let's get them out of the bags. Get a chicken. Like this. Let's just see if we can take it apart and build it. Who's that? Who's that? All right, let's build it. We gotta put this one on. Nope, <laughs> that's not the right one. We gotta do this one. There we go. Yay. Let's do this one. Uh oh, there's chicken head. Can you build it? There you go, good job. Good job. I'm going to put this one on. Boop. Uh oh. Do that one. Hmm. Crazy. When I worked at Six Flags, they called me Gonzo sometimes. I don't know why. <laughs> hey, it's Jabo, and it's time for the 100th episode spectacular. At least I think this... Is this the 100th day of the year? I hope it is. <laughs> if not, then there's no point in me wearing this shirt. Well, actually, it doesn't. It doesn't. I, yeah, Joey told me I needed to try to make my shirts that have numbers on them match something with the day. So uh, I think this is the 100th day of the year. And hopefully these are things you've never seen before. So this, <laughs> and it's probably things you never wanted to see before. So I got these Lego, I think these are from the Explore theme. These are chickens. And what year did this come out? Oh, it's got a, I mean, it's clearly Lego because it's got a Lego tag on it. It's got the Lego logo on the back of the chicken head. It's like a stackable toy, but it's plush also. But it does have a Primo rattle mixed in the middle of this, this green section. And uh, it's got a mirror on that side, on its butt. I don't know why you need a mirror on your butt. Um, so these are, it's older, so, uh, I'll put the year, oh, here it is, 2001. So, <laughs> Lego, <laughs> so that's the chicken, get the little f feet in the front, and then the little chicken tail, and he's got the little wings there, with the green and the lime, and then the I guess that's a chicken uh, primo rattle. I don't know. Does it come out? Does the primo rattle come out? Or is it? Oh, yeah. So we got that. So I put it back in there. And then so. So they put the blue and then the lime on it. I never was good at stacking toys. And then the collar. I think you can put a primo rattle in there too. But it's it's got a hole there so that when you suffocate the interior chicken it goes there and then the head the head is the one that it don't stick as good it's kind of like velcro and then oh i wonder if i'm doing this upside down i wonder if this i think i'm doing this upside down <laughs> i think the velcro is supposed to go on the top so that yeah that, that works better so we've got velcro to that then that velcro sticks to this and then there's velcro on top of that it goes there, and voila, you got a chicken. And if it wasn't for the Lego tags, I'd have a hard time probably convincing people <laughs> that these were Lego. 
I think somebody actually put them through the wash because this other one, the tags kind of, oh no, I killed my chicken. It's a little faded. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. So yeah, do, uh, Primo slash Explore, whatever the theme was in 2001. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have some chickens. And you've never seen these. Let, let me know in the comments if you've ever seen these. Has anybody seen these? I, don't lie. <laughs> and you may have seen them, but did you know what the, they were like this? I mean, do you... I'm pretty sure nobody wants these, but I, got, I had to get two of them. Now, these came from the Netherlands. I bought these on BrickLink, and there's not many for sale. Uh, and there was one seller, I think... Oh, there's two different set numbers for this. Uh, I guess one was like a North American release, or... I don't know. There's, there's, there's two different set numbers for the exact same thing. And so I think there's two different boxes, actually. And they, I thought about buying one with the box, but just the price without the shipping was going to be more than what I paid for these two with shipping, so I decided to buy these two without the box, because I wanted to open them anyway, so uh, may one day think about getting a sealed one, but it'd be pretty pricey, because these don't come a, a, up for sale very often, and uh, you're probably tired of me talking about it, so uh, this is Snap-on Tools, and um, I don't own any Snap-on tools, but I had this shirt. I do have a Snap-on tools train, and it was for the 100th anniversary of Snap-on tools. Uh, but this is the 100th episode of the year, and I hope I've shown you something that you didn't see before. I'll be back. I just... <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow, and hopefully we won't have a double decapitation demonetized.